Growing up in the 90s was a special time. The internet was growing, Pokemon was popular, and downloading music was all the rage. Now, as a broke kid with lots of desire to listen to music, what do you do? Anyone? Anyone? I'll tell you. You download it, of course. Or... Well, I wish I could say I had LimeWire growing up. But my dad was so cheap that we didn't even get LimeWire for music. We used a different service called BearShare. It was pretty much the same thing except with less users. Now, my parents always had the computer password protected, so we couldn't log on when we wanted. And when we did manage to get online, we would hope and pray that my mom wasn't going to use the phone anytime soon. Kids, get off the computer! So sometimes when my parents would go out, we would try and guess the password of the computer and hope that we'd get it right. We would never get it right though. So a solution we ended up coming up with is trying to not get the computer shut down in the first place. We would just shut down the monitor and we would just pray hard that they wouldn't notice that the computer was still on and then we'd be able to use it when they were gone. You know how you screwed up when you were downloading something? When you would double click on the song you just downloaded and then you'd hear this. My fellow Americans, I would once again like to say that I did not have sexual relations with that woman. This, ladies and gentlemen, is the sound of defeat. The sound of not getting the song of your choice. Some idiot somewhere named a song that you were looking for and disguised it as this garbage. It was absolutely infuriating. I'm so happy the internet has evolved into what it is now. It's much more easier to get a hold of the music that I want. Hey, Max. Stop them. <laughs> <laughs>